Turning now to the road to reopening, encouraging signs as New York City looks to enter phase two on Monday. Governor Cuomo is now set to make his final decision today on whether the city is in fact ready for the next step. Eyewitness News reporter Diana Rocco joining us live from the Upper West Side with more. Diana, good morning. Tony, good morning. This is a welcome change, right? If the phase two reopening does go forth on Monday, as expected, that could send 300,000 New Yorkers back to work and open restaurants back up again officially for uh, sidewalk dining. And uh, we could actually see roads start closing around the city to make way for outdoor diners. The city wants to help those struggling restaurants get back to business this morning, starting Monday with sit down service. They can now apply for out door seating expansions and should get instant approval from the city. That is uh, what is expanding outdoor dining. This is in Inwood. Dykeman streets will be closed to traffic. So street rather will be closed to traffic. So restaurants up and down the block can use that street to seat diners. The city's plans allow restaurants to use parking spaces for seating through Labor Day. Additionally, sidewalk seating will last through October and next month. The city will introduce open streets and plaza seating on nights and weekends. The idea is to bring the customers back, bring their livelihoods of the people who work there back, bring the money back in to keep the restaurants going. Obviously doing it in a safe way. We all want safety first. The governor is expected to give that official stamp of approval for the phase two reopening on Monday in his briefing a little bit later this morning.